Governor Tina Kotek announcing she is considering several line item vetoes for budget allocations from the 2024 legislative session. And the Rogue Valley was prominently featured on that list. NBC 5's Jenna King is live in studio with more. Jenna. Andrea, the potential vetoes primarily relate to a series of one-time funding allocations of Senate Bill 1530. That's pending additional information regarding new housing production resulting from the direct appropriations and related infrastructure projects. The governor's office has identified seven projects where more information is needed in order for the projects to be supported moving forward. The following funding allocations are being considered for potential line item vetoes in the Southern Oregon area. $1.5 million to the city of Butte Falls for wastewater treatment plant and lift station upgrades. $1.5 million to the city of Shady Cove for development of the city drinking and water system. And $1 million to the city of Gold Hill for replacement of a water distribution main line and upgrades to water treatment facilities. Governor Tina Kotek said in part, quote, before making final decisions, I'm giving cities and districts the opportunity to provide more information to my office to confirm whether these funding allocations will result in the production of new housing within an acceptable timeline, end quote. Governor Kotek will announce her final decision on these vetoes by April 17th. Live in studio, Jenna King, NBC5 News.